Nom, 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 nom. What would you start with then? What sort of plate for So, I'll actually, sauce this. So, I've got some homemade quince chutney that my wife's made. That's, that's pretty good. It's quite spicy, quite peppery. I've got some uh, roasted garlic and lemon mayonnaise. And then I've got some uh, vegan uh, cacao sauce uh, made by the guys at Broma Foods. So, uh, what, what would you say would sort of uh, be the best place to start this little food journey through the products? And what would you sort of pair with my sauces, do you reckon, Susan? Well, you, you said you like the rosemary. So, why don't you try. Yeah. Why don't you start with rosemary? Sounds good. Yeah, let's get to it. So rosemary and hemp then. So um, that's a combination I've not had before. It's going to be really, really exciting. So so tell us about the great taste award then, Susan, that this uh, rosemary product's got. It's really interesting. Yeah, so um, the Guild mm. of Fine Food, um, they run these taste awards and mm. uh, hundreds and hundreds of different, you know, brands. Mm. They send in all their products and they've got these different judges yeah um and uh it really helps consumers i think to know what tastes good so mm. very uh, very very tasty like um one of the things that i really like when i look up at the back of the, the ingredient deck is there's no oil in there straight away apple puree and um they're very sweet tastes really nice on its own it's really nice with my uh roast garlic lemon mayo and um so tell me a bit about the ingredient deck because you did quite a lot of development on this, didn't you? Yeah, we did. So we worked really hard. So we wanted to make sure um, that uh, just from the ingredients, mm. they were high protein, high yeah. fiber, great, low sugar, gluten free. Mm. Um, you know, great Fantastic. for schools and you know traveling and, mm. and things like that. We've also made sure there's no additives. Or yeah. preservatives, uh, so everything natural. Yeah, and it's 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 great to see how much protein's in there because um, this is um, thirty grams for a bag, isn't it? And you've got uh, over seven grams of protein in it, which is fantastic, and it's all natural plant protein. So I mean, this is kind of rivaling a lot of the natural protein bars that you'll see out there, isn't it? And it's a nice bagged kind of crispy alternative snack as well which is great um so it's good to see all the natural ingredients in this so i'm, I'm going to try the uh, the fennel and chia seed next big fan of fennel um so the other thing that i, I wanted to ask you about which um, i really liked when the products came through is y you've got compostable pouches haven't you yeah so um we thought that you couldn't have a grab and go product and yeah. and be vegan yeah. and introduce plastic into the planet. We work really hard to find this compostable material. Yeah, I think it's great because there, there are a lot of healthy products out there that um, have fantastic health credentials for the individual consumer, but they're not necessarily um, sort of followed through with the same level of quality on the uh, health credentials of the packaging for the planet. And it's great that, you know, you're sort of balancing that out. Well, th these these fennel and chia seed uh, snacks are absolutely brilliant. Um, really, really nice, oh, subtle like uh, aniseed flavour. Big fan of them. Go very, very yeah. nicely with that quince <laughs> chutney, actually. So I'll, uh, I'll be uh, recommending them to my wife later. Um, they're really crunchy as well. They, they, um, the texture is fantastic. Like you just kind of crumble and melt in the mouth. Love it. Fantastic texture you've got there. So I'm going to try the uh, cumin and linseed next. I think. Mm. I was just thinking this would be really good um, to have uh, before a curry instead of poppadoms. Actually, uh, if you're watching this, go and have a check of uh, Pepper Necker's website. Have a look at the the recipe blog feed there because there's some great ideas on it. Um, you kind of got loads of interesting things from sort of porridge and breakfast right through to uh, to puddings on there, haven't you? I like to put them. In salads, mm. uh, so they're very nice to crunch up to to give salads some more texture. Yeah, and also soups like croutons. Yeah, that could have been lovely. Yeah, bread. yeah, nice um, carrot and coriander soup that go very well yeah. with. Check out pepper lecker seed snacks, cumin and linseed. You'll absolutely love it. It's great, really good. Thanks for watching this video guys, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and hit the bell icon to be notified when we upload a new video. Let us know in the comments below if you have any suggestions, click the link on the left to check out a playlist with similar videos to this series in and check out the one on the right to watch our previous upload. Thanks again and see you soon!